Hey friends! So the last time we did a formal updo tutorial, you all loved it. So great news, here we are doing another one for you. So I'm going to be using Josie as my model and we're doing a fantastic updo that you can do on yourself in less than five minutes. Don't forget to like this video so more people can see our content and also hit that subscribe button so that you can get more inspiration for your beauty routines every single week. Alright, so I'm going to start by prepping her hair with a little bit of texture spray. And then I will just tie it in a low ponytail. At this point you want it to be more secure. Um, so if it's you know your ears are showing and different things like that it's okay we'll pull those little details out later so do a simple pony and then I'm gonna flip it through make a little hole and then just tuck the hair through tighten it back up I'm going to use a little bit more hairspray to kind of keep some of these ends together. And I am also using a little bit more spray for her baby hairs so that I can help tuck those up into the updo. Now I'm taking this, I'm flipping it tucking the ends into the style and then pinning this into place. This is a great hairstyle because if you have short hair or long hair, it works for both. And then you're going to want to start pinning on the outside so that you can bring the hair and tuck it so there's not a gap right here. If one side is a little bit messier, that's okay. Um, there's two ways you can do this. so. If you have longer hair, it can end up being more sleek. And if you have shorter hair, just roll with it. Um, she has some layers in her hair, so some of these are just wanting to come out a little bit. So I'm just going to start pulling stuff out for extra texture. Some of these little hairs that are just not long enough to go in, like from below all the way to above to tuck them in, just wrap them in your bobby pin and then put them in under. Now it comes to the part where I will start pulling out. I love pulling it out above so you can get more volume in the crown. Right. And again with these little guys, they're bound to fall out, that's okay. We'll just tuck them under. Now I will be pulling hair out around her face. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is one of my absolute favorite tutorials to do on myself and other brides. It's so easy and I'm giving my secrets away. So tag us in your photos if you try it out and let us know how you love it.